It's Feedback Gaming. Welcome back, guys, to my series where I'm playing as Japan. We're making a push towards Moscow. It looks like it's going pretty well, actually. Let's see a look if the planes are actually making any difference whatsoever. Uh, yeah, it is. 7% 7 uh, 7 reduction. I guess 7%. I guess 7% is pretty good, actually. I don't know why I, uh, I brushed that off like it's nothing. That's actually pretty good. What are we doing for guns? Ooh, we're having issues with, with factories. Why? We... Oh, I think they've just been reshuffled. Okay, I, I get. I guess what happened. I know what's happened. Um, I'm gonna do that and focus on the planes to make a variant of the tank. Do we want to make a variant on the tank? I'm starting to think the heavy tank might have been a good idea. I know superior firepower seems to. I don't know, it t seems to favour the tank, doesn't it? The heavy tank. I'm starting to think that that might not be a good idea. I think I might need to focus on lights. Hmm. The fall of Berlin. Oh, boy. So, what might happen here is they might look like they're losing in the, the, the west, but what happens is I help them in the east, and that might balance them out, maybe. We'll see. Um, decryption is done. Working on construction. That's a year away. That's a year away. So we've done that. Light tank. The Hago. I love the names of the tanks for Japan. They're awesome. Hago. Alright, boys. Make a push. Alright, we have another airport here. Let's use it. And uh, we need to make different variants of planes now. So, engine is mega important. The good thing about engine improvements too is it doesn't reduce the reliability, which is very good. Um, Tactical Bomber 2 increases... Oh, I can't make a variant. Okay. But we'll make the tacticals anyway. So what do we need now? We need rubber, a little bit of aluminium, a little bit of oil, we don't need as much steel anymore. Get it all from the Soviets and then we've taken Moscow. Yee! And they've taken Leningrad so it's pretty much near enough over now. Um, looking for some cities so we can just zap their war score. Can we just finish that? Yep. Extra factories. I think we'll focus on the tanks, maybe. Ooh, it's because we've taken Moscow, isn't it? That's the reason why. Yeah, look at all those factories. Sweet. Awesome. Alright, we can work on the, the bigger artillery now, too. And there you go, the Soviet Union has been demolished. We have the most war score. Okay, so liberate is the ability just to free the country, isn't it? Reduces world tension. Change the government. How many points do we have? It doesn't say. Whereabouts is the points? I always get confused. So 2,962, is that it? Oh, but this is the ones we take. Oh, I see, right. Okay. Um, okay. So we're going to try for pretty borders, okay? First of all, we take all the corner provinces. I could liberate. I could liberate Republic of Georgia. Hmm. Hmm. 
I think what I do is I definitely 100% want to take Siberia. Siberia is mine, no doubt about it. And then... Re liberate the Republic of Ukraine. I've never done this before, so I'm a bit confused what you do. How come this all turns a different colour? I thought it just liberated the country. I didn't realise it had to... Republic of Belarus. Azerbaijan. Ukraine. Armenia. Georgia. It is. Okay, so when I liberate them, I have to give them the land. <laughs> oh, God. Prepare for ugly borders. <laughs> okay. Um, Germany's taken Minsk. All right, well, there you go. The Soviet Union. Belarus is never going to happen now. Is this is this what Republic of Ukraine is? Yeah, it is. Fuck. And create a mini Ukraine here. I'm taking Leningrad. Uh, the state, the Belarus. So. Not ethnically Belarusian, but whatever. Whatever, it'll do. It'll do. Oh, they've gone for it. Oh, they've gone for the ports, haven't they? All right, okay, that's it. That's that's me trying to draw the 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 map, my color. Armenia, Georgia. Yeah, okay. All right, we're done now. Okay, so let's just clean up what we've got. What we'll do after this as well is we'll try and stop Germany from getting too strong and powerful by giving it to the liberated territories. That's what I'm gonna try and do. That was the plan overall, anyway. Because, guys, we are peaceful Japan overall, right? Right? Okay, so this is the borders we've created. Um, the state of Azerbaijan is here. Give them that. Um, Ukraine, Armenia. Oh, shit, yeah, there's different ones here. It's a shame because it doesn't show the colors right, so it's a bit confusing. Georgia. We'll give, we'll give Crimea to Georgia, right? Historical. <laughs> There's Georgia. There we go. Oh, we gotta wait. What? This is Georgia, right? Yeah. I don't really recognize the flag. It confuses me a little bit. <laughs> I've tried to make a buffer state here, and what's actually happened is they're gonna fill in the middle, aren't they? I know that's what they're gonna do. Um, is there any way that I could avoid that? I don't think I can. Unless I create some really ugly borders. Because uh, what's going to happen is they're going to go down the north part as well. So there really isn't a way of doing it. See, when you release nations, there should always be an option to kind of... Uh, be able to, Every single territory should be able to give them to like a foreign power as such. I guess what I could have is I could have created a new nation here, couldn't I, for the, for the Russians. Ah, that's exactly what I should have done, actually. I should have created a Russian nation here. Ah, I never thought of that. Fuck. Okay. Lessons have been learned. All right, everyone, get here. Up, go here. Reinforce the borders. Ended. Um, okay, so we have interests. Okay, in the world. All right, we have interests. So our interests are squared towards helping out. Helping out. We're not even producing any convoys. We're not. All oh, right, shit. Um, okay, this is probably going to sound really weird because we're democratic overall, but we're looking out for our own self-interest here. So what we're going to do is supply the Germans with guns. All right. Yeah, we're supplying the Germans with guns. Now I have fascism defeated. Right. Yep. Um, 
do 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 do. Air defense, enemy air support, ground support. I like concealment because it gives you guys your extra speed. We're making more troops. Um, is there any way you can give all the divisions back to them? Should be a nice little shortcut key for that. That would be nice, wouldn't it? Uh, now these are troops that we've created, aren't they? These ones. Yeah, they get given back to them. Uh, so give them back. It take ages to organize all of this. Yeah, those are the ones that I've created. We might at some point ask for them back, but I'd prefer them to look after their own troops just for the time being. Alright, and those are the ones that are ours. That one isn't. There we go. And these guys are going to be on the border. Um, we're going to convert the horses, weren't we? Yeah, let's convert the horses to mountain troops. Solving trouble with attrition here, really? Uh, we'll, we'll give another another two. the factories all right we sent them any guns yet oh it's the, the lend lease has ended what 90 percent 90 percent 90%. Oh, they've gone to war with Greece while well, they're already stuck in a war versus the Allies and they're not winning. Hmm. 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 We do not fulfill our... Uh... Oh, we need lots of steel. Oh, shit. And Chuko. And then... Where's that final puppet? China, Manchuko, and there's Menchuko, isn't there as well? Why are they not on the list? Are they in the list or am I missing them? No, I can't find them. All right, we can sort out our guns now. Oh, I realize we're switching guns out. That's not a good idea, because we're supplying them with guns, aren't we? Oops. Oh, the lend lease has ended again. Is it because we don't have a possible route? I think it is, isn't it? Because this is blocked, isn't it? Oh, it's all right. The, the Italians are beating the French back. When France falls, it's pretty much over anyway. All right, super economy, right? The Republic of Georgia has declared war on the Republic of Georgia. Ah. Ah. Well, I guess we should help out the Democrats, right? <laughs> I am actually really proud of this. This actually looks really good, in my opinion. This, on the other hand, not so much. Oh, actually, I gave Georgia here, didn't I? Oh, of course, it's good split, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Let's have a look. So, zero troops versus zero troops. This is going to be a long, grueling civil war, boys. What? We don't have any more? Um... So, the supply routes is to here. In that case, we should max this one out. Um... 
And then we're going from here too, so we should max this one out. And then more civilian factories. Yes. Yugoslavia has joined the Allies. Oh, another war. Another front line they're going to have to deal with. <laughs> so maybe I should send it to the Italians, maybe? I don't know. Are they doing alright? Are you doing alright, guys? Can I send you these, or is this going to cancel straight away? Hmm. I realise if I go for extensive right now, I'd actually be okay for manpower, wouldn't I? Relations. Okay, so what kind of front? Oh, there we go. France has fallen. That's actually really good because that means that obviously a lot of divisions are going to be lost, and then there's a going to be a big pocket here. But then again, I don't know. It's difficult to say. Oh no, no, the Italians are getting the guns. Sixty-three divisions. Got the horse and the marines. We're gonna switch those out to mountain troops. Got a few artillery there as well. Do, 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 do. Go to this city. Omsk, Omsk, Omsk. All right, they've uh, they've been recalibrated our uh, factory output. Okay, is that how we want it to be? Maybe. We don't need nowhere near as much artillery anymore. Don't need as much support equipment either. We've got engineers now, so we can add the engineers on and the. Artillery, maintenance, change these out to motorized, motorized. Uh, yep. I think I'm happy with that. I need motorized now. Yep, that's decent. Are you receiving those guns? Did they receive them? Yes, they did. In that case, we'll pump it to Italy full of goodness then, right? So, where's the new guns? Oh, it's there. Production, 90%. Production, 90%. Production, 90%. Production, 90%. Okay, so to get the most from China. No, I think I'm going to keep China as it is. I think I like the way it looks right now. I'm moving towards democracy. I want to do a coup. I could do all a coup for all. Whoa, this is really, this is like next level democracy. I can do a coup for fascism even though I'm democratic. Wow. Ukraine is really strong, but then Belarus, one military factory. Communist revolutionaries. What? I made you democratic. Uh, aluminium, oil. Don't need the steel. As much steel. We are at some point going to max this out. Why are you doing that? Here... Uh, here, here, here. They all come from here, so we'll do this one too, and then that one too. That's a lot of infrastructure. What I want to do is, eventually, I mean, we can't deny this, but eventually we are going to have to attack the Germans. I mean, fascism is bad, right? Right? God, what's going on here? How come I haven't got this finished? 
Uh, we could work on rockets. Right now, we have an abundance of tech, guys. We have so much technology. So, we have lots of opportunity to uh, play catch up. <laughs> okay, so he's doing better. Italy's pushed them out. We've got a bit of Greece at the bottom of Italy. Pushing through northern France. Um, yep. That finished really quickly, that didn't it? Alright, that'll be done soon. We're working on the mediums. Uh, we're going to work on rockets. Can't go for extensive. I guess we could drop down from free market because free market's only given as a boost for research time and construction speed, isn't it? Hmm, I'm gonna gain in a little bit from that. I would imagine trading with Germany. Yeah, we are. I'm not gonna upgrade that. We're gonna wait for the medium tank. Upgrade those guns. Okay, for some reason, yet again. I can't send the guns. Don't ask me why, no idea. Have they got a lack of convoys, maybe? I'm just making an assumption. I have no idea. It's not looking too good for Germany. Okay, so... Um, oh, I forgot we get to choose between the different kinds of ship designs, don't we? So screening ships get a massive boost, but an extra production cost. Max range, capital ship armor. Carrier has 50% more armor. Wow. Deck size. Yeah, that's usually the best one, isn't it? This reduces the cost. I'm going to go for that one. I'm not going to be making any ships, though, am I? I'm pumping a few light carriers, or light cruisers. Could make some mechanized too, couldn't I? Do, 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 do. Oh, what's this? The Spanish have joined the Axis. Was this is going to give them a little bit of a boost? Are the guns still sending? No legal path. Ah, okay, that explains it then. Yeah, there's no way that I can get to them. Which is kind of weird because we can kind of go around the world and then go to here, but apparently that's no legal path. Is it something to do with we've blocked it here with this? <laughs> the AI can't handle that. It's too much. Alright. This is my 20 combat width. This guy has an offensive doctrine, so I can make this bigger now. So we can go for 22. I don't need anything else added on. Nope. And... Uh, we're going to go for a 22 combat width with this guy as well. Light, medium, medium. Yep. Hang on a second, I just added on a heavy then, didn't I? That was... Oh, that is a medium. Hang on a minute, we can add on mediums, but we have not got mediums researched. Oh, we do have some mediums. We have the mediums that we've stolen. Don't we? Yeah, we do. Hang on, these are lights, aren't they? I don't know. I thought we sent them some guns before. This is what happens when you turn non-historical on, guys. Really wacky things happen that even I can't even explain. I don't even know what's going on. Alright, gonna expand you. 
Don't need you anymore. I think it's safe to say that we don't need the guns either, do we? Yep. Do away with that. Extra roll of tactical bombers. Cool. I guess it'd be stupid not to have the mechanized, wouldn't it? So let's add on the mechanized too. I think that's what I need to do more often, you know. I wait until I've got like 50,000 mechanized before I even start using them. That's a stupid strategy, actually. I need to uh, just start using them immediately. Can I send you the guns? I just want to take these guns off my hand. They're like hotcakes. Come on, dude. Just let me send you the guns. Come on. Let me send you the guns. No legal path for you, so we'll cancel that off. Is there going to be no legal path for you as well, Mr. Spain? As insufficient convoys. Yeah, I'm aware of that. So that means you have to send them in portions. Small amounts. This is a bit of a deja vu in my Italy game, isn't it? Hmm. Georgia, have you made a division yet? You've made one. Is he going to start pushing against the evil communists that have separated Georgia into two pieces? Decisive battle. Um, that gives a lot of buffs. 10% for attack and defense, like 40% buff. And this is a lot, lot less. But naval air ability from carriers. He is an expert, though. Uh, they're both really good, but one of them does more damage, so... Okay, they are moving towards becoming a puppet. I'm not careful. Um. How do we solve that? We build a really glorious airport in the... And then we... Alright, switch out to the light tank. Uh, we're not going to make a custom model, actually. No, we're not going to make a model. We'll make the standard. Yeah, we need to do something with you, don't we? So, in that case, we'll build forts. Yeah, and that'll give them less liberty desire. I'll make a big airport, too. Actually, the airport will be better about here. And infrastructure here, too. This should really low their autonomy. Yeah, it's dropping by at least. How many points a day? No points a day. Oh, I'm looking at the wrong one. Whoops. Yeah, it's dropping about four points a day. Yep, four points a day. Luxembourg has capitulated. Aha! It looks like the uh, the axes are winning now. Are we selling the guns? Oh. Oh, wait. Yeah, we did. Yeah, we did. Uh, 1,040 guns sent. Yeah, we are sending the guns. Alright, Mountaineer. No, we don't need you anymore. Marines. Ha. Alright. We have a lot of divisions. Okay, is there anything we can focus on that's gonna benefit us? Oh, we can defend into China now. Okay, let's do it. I have a funny feeling we're gonna get a Cassus Belly and we won't be able to use it, but that's okay. Uh, engineers. Do 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 do. You think about it, all the industry they've got here, 11 factories here, 14 here, 14 here, 20 there, 9 there. Look at all these factories that Britain's got. Makes Britain strong. I'm like two actually, and that's not too many. Do 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 do. We don't need to focus on reinforcements. 
as a main priority anymore. All right, we're going to move on to rockets now. this chromium we've got. No one wants it. Oh no, looks like they're kind of pushing back a little bit. There's a bit of a push for Berlin again. Spain's doing quite well. This is the stimulus package for the Japanese people. Loads of civilian factories in Tokyo, Kasai, and the other one. And this one, Chugoku. The Allies really want us to join, you know? Okay, the Italians have made a break into Yugoslavia. Repelling the New Zealanders in the tip of Italy. How's the Italian Navy? Decimated. German Navy. Decimated. Also trying to take Gibraltar as well. Service by requirement. How's, are my guns arriving? Yep, sent 3,200. Nice. Reduction is 0.5%. Alright, I don't think we're going to take off the naval bomber, even though we've got so many naval bombers. Alright, I think we're good for this episode. We've managed to carve up Japan, make some really ugly puppets. Well, not puppets, uh, liberate. Oh, the Civil War's over. And the Democrats were, were victorious. I think what we're going to do now is arrange a coup for democracy in the British Raj. I think that's a good idea. How is the autonomy points for China? A lot better. No colony for you, brah. Alright, that's it guys. I hope you've had, uh, enjoyed this episode. Remember to like and subscribe. Make sure to hit that like button. I'll see you guys on the next episode. Have a good day. Bye-bye.